So Arch Manning commits to Texas officially. So he chose them over Georgia and Alabama, which is very interesting. Um, I think it goes along with the lines with the fact that Alabama already chose a quarterback. Um, they had basically already brought in a top recruit, so they were pretty much out of the running anyways. Um, Georgia, I don't know the whole situation there. I know Texas was high on his list. Um, so that's, uh, that's big news that dropped today. So that's going to be very interesting going forward to see how Texas, um, you know, controls the situation and reacts to it. Um, cause they got Quinn Ewers from, uh, Ohio state that's in right now. So now that's going to create a quarterback dynamic where if he doesn't step up to the plate, if Quinn does not do what he's, everyone's saying he's going to do and improve Texas, then he's got Manning right there behind him. That's going to be hype, uh, hype. He's already extremely hyped up. He's going to be ready to go. And that's going to be a lot of pressure on him to, uh, to get it going like fast. Um, so he's going to, he has a terrible offensive line though. So, and he does not have a defense that's going to help him out either. His Texas defense has been absolutely terrible for a while now. And offensive line has not improved as far as we've seen. Um, so yeah, we'll see how this all plays out. Um, that's really big news for Texas. Um, we simply don't know right now though, how good Manning's going to be because he's been extremely hiked up. Um, just because his last name, he was good in high school. I will give him that, but the main reason why he's high test because his last name, let's not, let's not be around the bush here. So we'll see how good he does. But like I said, we just don't, we simply just do not know right now until we see him actually play on the field in a college football environment. So yeah, this is going to be interesting to watch, see how Sark rotates these guys if he decides to do something like that or if he just sticks to one we'll just have to see um i mean if quinn doesn't get it done like i said he could at some point pull him and put manning in and see how that goes um yeah really interesting dynamic at, at texas we're gonna have to watch um for a while now uh, especially the next couple of years. We'll see if both quarterbacks stay there. I don't think that they will. I think Quinn's probably going to be transferring out again to another school if that happens um, because it's just it's just one of those situations. It's going to turn into a toxic situation, kind of like how Oklahoma had last year. And I, I, hate it for, I hate it for both of them, but it is what it is. That's just because social media blew this up so badly. But... Yeah, we'll just, have, like I said, we'll just have to watch and see. All right, have a good day, guys.